Hello again. Um, so in this video, I'm going to attempt to install Django in Windows 7. So um, starting out, what we need is we need to download Django. So um, actually starting from DjangoProject.com, uh, just grab the latest release, which at this point is 1.3.1. So when you click this link, you get um, the latest official version. So I've already downloaded this, but this is the link you want. This downloads a tar.gz file, uh, which is like a zip file. Um, tar is a tape archive, which is a collection of files and folders. Uh, GZ means it's gzipped, uh, zipped, compressed with GNU zip. So when you download these files, uh, or that file, you should get this, django.1.3.1.targc. So we have to extract that. And to do that, I use a program called 7-Zip. Um, you can Google for it, download it. That's pretty easy to do. Um, and uh, once you open 7-Zip, you can tell it where to look for files. And I just uh, copied and pasted actually did this. Um, copy that, go to 7-Zip, paste it here, um, and hit enter. So here's my here's my Django tar gz file. So I'm going to extract that. It's going to ask me where I want to extract it to. By default, it chooses the same directory. And so what you get is um, a folder uh, that also has the tar tar file. So all we did is um, unzip it, uncompress it. Now we have to extract all this stuff from the tar file. So I'm going to do that. Extract again. And again, I'm just going to let it choose the default directory. So Django's got a lot of stuff. And this might take just a, a minute. And while that's going, um, well, it's almost done. So, okay, we're done. Um, so I'm going to close 7-Zip. And I'm going to go back to my Downloads folder. So I'm going to click into this folder. Um, uh, this is the tar file. This is the folder. It uh, looks like we've got one more. Okay, finally. So this is Django. This is all the stuff you get when you install Django. Um, so where do I go from here? Well, there is a file called setup.py. Uh, it is, a, as you see, it's a Python file. Um, I've got Windows doesn't show me file extensions. Um, which is unfortunate, but this is a Python file. I can execute this script and it will install Django. So I'm going to run this from the command line. And to do that, I need this path. So I'm just going to copy that. Right? That's going to help me get to this directory on the command line. Then I'm going to open a command prompt. Um, and I don't even know where the command prompt program is, but I I use the run command and then type cmd and that gives me the command prompt. Okay, so now I have to tell my command prompt to, to look in the same directory that Django is located. So I'm going to um, I'm going to crap, I forgot how to write I forgot how to paste. Um, you uh, right click and paste in here. And I forgot to type CD in front of that. So <clears throat> before you do anything, type CD space and then right click and paste that path. Then hit enter. So let me move my window a little bit. All right, so um, you could type DIR and you will see a list of the files just so you know you're in the right directory and my window is kind of small so it it 
wraps the it wraps the uh, directory name around. But I'm going to type Python setup.py install. That's three words. Python space setup.py space install. So you'll see a bunch of stuff fly by the screen. That means um, Django is getting installed. Now, where it's getting installed is kind of another story, but essentially your your um, your installation of Python has this um, operating system level directory where it installs all Python uh, libraries. That's that's where it's going. And if you uh, if you could see it as it flies by, it actually tells you. The path um, C colon Python 27 lib side packages and then some other stuff. Um, if you're cu curious, you can you can scroll back through this once it's finished and, and find out. All right, so uh, looks like we're done, and here's here's where it went. Uh, Python 27 lib site packages and then a folder called Django. All right, cool. So um, at this point, we should have Django installed. So just to, to test that out, I'm going to type Python. So I'm in a Python interpreter, and I'm going to try to import Django. Yes, um, no, nothing exploded. I got no errors, so that means Django is installed.